hello guys so now we are going to start with one small derivation and also this derivation can be asked the transfer gain with feedback okay so along with the block diagram of feedback this derivation can be asked this is the modified version of that block diagram of feedback amplifier the answer they go to happy basic amplifier or feedback network do no block same hai. आउटपुट साइड पे अपने पास वहाँ पे आर एल था लोड यहाँ पे भी है वहाँ पे जो आउटपुट सिग्नल जो फीडबैक ज्वाइन किया हुआ है उसको कंपेरेटर और मिक्सर इनपुट साइड पे और आउटपुट पे सैम्पलिंग नेटवर्क ओके okay, तो यहाँ पे वो ब्लॉक की जगह पे डायरेक्ट हमने कनेक्ट किया हुआ है एंड दैट कनेक्शन कोड भी सीरीज और शन बेस्ड ऑन दैट वी हैव डिफरेंट डिफरेंट टोपोलॉजीज ओके नाउ वी आर डीलिंग इन टर्म्स ऑफ क्वान्टिटी एवरीवेयर वी यूज एक्स बिकॉज we are using a generalized concept for feedback so it could be a voltage source or a current source if it is a voltage source then we can replace x by v and if it is a current source we can replace x by a so for generalize we are using x so we are starting with the input input signal is x of s it is applied in the mixer or a comparator network where feedback signal is also returning back from the output of an amplifier and that xf is equal to beta xo beta is the gain of feedback network and xo is the output signal that is output signal xo and which is also depending on the input to the amplifier and the gain of the basic amplifier so voltage or a current xo is equal to a into xi that is the input signal to the amplifier and xi or xd means the difference signal xi basically input pe jo apply hua hai wo x of s hai aur jo feedback se aa raha hai wo xf hai ye dono ka jo difference hota hai wahi amplifier ko aata hai so we can say depending on the type of feedback x of s plus xf ho sakta hai ya fir x of s minus xf ho sakta hai okay तो जो भी रहेगा वो होगा एक्स डी और एक्स आई नाउ वी आर स्टार्टिंग विद द डेरिवेशन बेस्ड ऑन दिस डायग्राम सो वी हैव बेसिक एम्पलीफायर मे बी वोल्टेज ट्रांसकंडक्टेंस करंट और ट्रांसराइजेंस एनी फोर एम्पलीफायर्स कट भी दे कुछ भी ले सकते हैं बट वी आर स्टार्टिंग द डेरीवेशन इन ए जर्नलाइज फॉर्म सो एज पर द डाइग्राम वी हैव x of d is equal to x of s plus minus xf if it is a negative feedback then we are using negative sign if it is a positive feedback then we are using positive sign so this is nothing but xi that is the input of basic amplifier mark it as equation number 1 so this difference or our error signal or we can say it is a comparison so reverse transmission factor and it is also known as gain that is beta so beta basically a relation if you consider beta as a two port network then what would be the gain of this so output of feedback network is xf and the input to the feedback network is xo so beta is given as xf divided by xo as per the diagram mark it as a equation number 2 now the transfer gain a a is the gain of basic amplifier amplifier output is xo and the input is xi so a is given as xo by xi so this is our equation number 3 so all three equations we write as per the diagram so just draw the diagram mark it label it and then first start with xi then beta then a after this we are going to use this three equation now the transfer gain with feedback means end to end gain end to end means at the extreme output we have xo and the extreme input it is x of s so xo by x s it is the gain with feedback and this is our equation number 4 to kya kya kiya sabse pehle x hai then beta then gain of amplifier and then the gain of amplifier with feedback now from equation number 1 that is xi 
we have the value x of s minus plus xf and from equation number 2 we have beta is equal to x so by xf or we can write xf is equal to beta into xo okay so in this way we can put the value of x of f into equation number one from two so xi become x of s minus plus beta xo again from equation number three we can write the value of x i basically we are transforming the equation in terms of xo so xi ki jaga pe bhi xo kar diya xo upon a that is the gain of amplifier now put this value in equation number one so in place of xi we have xo upon a x of s as it is minus plus x of is replaced by beta x of now all the output quantity is one side and input at one side so beta x so equal to the other side pe jayega. so minus plus becomes plus minus take x so common then we have one upon a plus minus beta is equal to x of s take lcm it become one plus minus a beta divided by a and what is af af is nothing but x so by x of s so the gain with feedback is given as a upon 1 plus minus a beta so this is the derivation for gain with feedback now the condition it is positive for negative feedback and negative for positive feedback Kaise? basically if the feedback is negative then we have 1 minus and minus of negative feedback so it becomes 1 plus a beta and for positive feedback it is 1 minus a beta okay that's why the line is correct if the positive it is positive for negative feedback and it is negative for positive feedback and as a generalized we have 1 upon 1 plus minus a beta okay so it is for feedback amplifier for negative feedback it is a upon 1 plus a beta okay so we can conclude that if af that is mod af less than a means agar feedback gain basic amplifier gain se kam hota hai that means it is a negative or a degenerative network or a negative feedback is there if the feedback gain is greater than basic amplifier then means it is a regenerative or we can say it is a positive feedback and the this circuit also known as oscillators so this is a small derivation that can be asked for 5 to 10 marks next we have one more important characteristics of negative feedback amplifier because in this chapter we are going towards the negative feedback and next module 6 that is oscillator which is purely based on positive feedback so ab baat karte hai, ke negative feedback reduces the gain but by which factor always there is an improvement or we can say for negative feedback the gain reduces also we can say it improves the bandwidth it improves the stability there are certain parameter which it can improve just like input and output impedance it improves but it reduces the gain but by which factor so that can be given by desensitivity of transfer amplification what is desensitivity the fractional change in amplification with feedback divided by the fractional change without feedback is called sensitivity of the transfer gain okay so first we derive the sensitivity then inverse of that is nothing but the desensitivity fractional change means differential okay check at them so modulus of daf upon da so derivative with respect to da kiska af so we have value of af from the above derivation that is a upon 1 plus a beta plus q consider kia because it is a negative feedback now we differentiate 
this equation with respect to a after differentiation we have u by v rule so d a f is equal to 1 plus a beta d a minus a beta into d 1 plus beta 1 plus a beta whole square then d a f is equal to some parameters got cancelled if you open the bracket then we have d a divided by 1 plus beta square now dividing both side by af d af by af so af ka value a upon 1 plus a beta it gets cancelled so finally we are having sensitivity as 1 upon 1 plus a beta mod so this is the equation for sensitivity 1 upon 1 plus a beta so what should be the desensitivity desensitivity is the inverse of sensitivity so d is equal to 1 plus a beta so the reciprocal of sensitivity is desensitivity and this d that is 1 plus a beta this is the factor which is always used the fractional change in gain without feedback is divided by the desensitivity when feedback is added so we can say af is equal to a divided by d as from the previous equation af is equal to a upon 1 plus a beta and that 1 plus a beta is nothing but d so we can say that with feedback the gain reduces or gain is divided by the factor d matlab jo gain kam hota hai wo kitna kam hota hai by the factor d if we can say the impedance is improved means jisko zyada chahiye wahan pe impedance zyada hoga jisko kam chahiye wahan pe impedance kam hoga suppose voltage amplifier input impedance requirement should be high output should be low so with feedback input impedance zyada ho jayega kitna zyada by the factor d so r i into d and for output with feedback ro divided by d because it requires low isi tarah se mai baat karta hu transconductance ki transconductance mein kya hota hai input aur output both are required as high as possible so by using feedback both input and output impedance are increases by the factor d similarly for trans resistance both input and output impedance required as low as possible so in that case both input and output resistance is divided by d okay so this is the concept or we can say by using feedback the gain is reduces but the impedance are enhanced the bandwidth is enhanced the stability is enhanced so in the next video we will discuss what factors are responsible for the stability and apart from stability what other factors are improved by using this feedback thank you